your helmet the motel behind you and then there's a bar underneath here we'll we'll run the camera through the store and then we'll go down to the bar and she's making a smash burger from their cattle so that's kind of exciting grass fed well not kind of it is so i gotta go in there and warm up and keep on keeping on <laughs> summertime they do have ice cream I have not had it yet but nice little spacers windows I should mention coming down C5 heading into Redfield the, the snowmobile trail does come down to the store and the, the uh, bar restaurant motel so fishing or no? It's a little cold out there to be freaking standing on the water today. see the store's got a little bit for everybody you know you got your drinks you got your candy your seasonings some more candy you can buy some little uh, gifts I bought Leilani a picture of a Highland cow from here and we'll get the hours and stuff from her so you guys all know of uh, the store and the barn grill Steve, you gonna try half of this on camera with me? Man, you already been in one of my videos once. <laughs> Everybody's watching me. <laughs> oh, he's take too big of a bite for the camera. Can you tell your secrets, like what it's seasoned with? Uh, it's a Hamburg spice. Well, let me hold on. <laughs> if you look at that little sign on the wall, it says grass, local grass fed hamburger. That's those cows that you see in the beginning of the, or the bulls or the Highland cows. I like the season, seasoning. Did you do American cheese on this one? I did. They say, Chef Ramsey says, that's what you gotta do. I use three different seasonings. I use an amazing burger seasoning, a garlic herb seasoning, and an Italian seasoning um, in the burgers. And then we make them into quarter pound balls and we smash them on the grill. And so it's a half pound smash burger. And you can choose whatever cheese you'd like. So, I've eaten here a few times, kind of sneaking around a little bit. I have had the, what do you call the fish you cut up into chunks? 
Fish bites? So I've had the fish bites. If you know anything about me, I never eat fish out of Rochester because I just feel like people don't do a good job. I actually loved them and would get them again. Fridays only? Friday and Saturdays if we haven't left yep. available. So it was very good. It was it was cooked. To, I like them a little extra crispy. They were crispy. I was able to pick them up because I don't like to use the fork. I also have had the steak sandwich. Me and my dad both got <laughs> matching sandwiches. He's like, just give me everything he has. Very good meat, juicy, tastes good. I'm very picky when it comes. I like to get the basic stuff every time anyways. I didn't have to put anything on it. It was sauteed mushrooms. Mushrooms, onions, onions and peppers, peppers. With your choice of cheese again. Yep, and then we had the A1 sauce. I, we like our condiments in our family. And then I had a pizza the other night. I will insert the photo here. And I crushed that. Um, it was very good. Like I, we all love pizza. I think uh, I just liked it. I just have no like critique or like any anything good to, like bad to say. It's just good. And I ate the last three slices cold in the morning. I like to eat all my food cold pretty much. And there is just some pizza you can't eat cold, and that pizza was definitely you could eat it cold. So I enjoyed my breakfast the next day. So I ate a large myself, I'm fat. And then I came back again, was it last night and I got the chicken fingers and the deep fried cheese curds. I have nothing bad to say, <laughs> like deep fried cheese and then chicken fingers. Every, I like chicken fingers anywhere I go, so. That's kind of what I've had. Um, that's that was the bar menu. I don't know if you have something different. Can you tell us your like hours, like if you can pull everything together? Sure. We're open on Fridays from eight to three. The bar opens up three to eleven. Saturdays we're open eight to five in the store restaurant, and the bar opens up at one to eleven. And Sundays we're open in the store from eight to one, and the bar opens at one to five. And on Mondays we're open eight to one. <laughs> that's a lot of different hours, so. When in doubt, just look in the description below and call ahead, <laughs> is what I would say. And we're gonna go down and check the bar out. Like, delicious burger, I like it. Um, I don't like when you bite into a burger and it just tastes just like the meat, and that's not the case here. The seasoning she put on it, perfect. So let's go check the bar out. Guys, you can pull around the back and then you come in this door and then you walk through here and then we got the bar so if you take C5 coming from either way you can the trail comes right up to the back of this bar and you can park in the back the motel as well so if you guys are wondering So we're sitting here with Steve Tubbs and this tabletop came off of the Tug Hill Highland Ranch and landed in Steve's possession and you built it. How long did it take? Uh, a couple weeks. Can can anybody buy tables like this from you? Absolutely. Anytime. What do we got to do to do it? Do that? Just 585-317-3191 um, and I have a whole stock of inventory 
And if you like these, I'm sure I can get wood from the owner of this wood. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so this is all Redfield, Redfield wood. It's cherry, right? Yes. A big hunk of cherry, and then there's going to be a bar upstairs, so when that's finished, we'll come back and we'll check that out too, which Steve also built that bar as well. Yep. So that's what we got for you guys. You want to come stand behind us? So uh, like I keep saying, I've been dying to do a video like this. I, I absolutely love Juanita. We, we met her at another bar in the town and just became friends over time, and once, once I knew she was getting the... Uh, this place i was like i want to do a video with you guys so and we definitely wanted to wait till this time of year when it got closer to the snow season as well and as you can see she they got a great thing going with the the cabins and then the motel the store upstairs the bar down here it's just all around it's it reminds me of uh norm where everybody knows your name you know so you come in here it just feels homey and and that's what i look for in a bar like knowing all the people knowing the bartender knowing the knowing pretty much everybody here so it's this is a great place and uh we're gonna wrap this up Juanita thank you for uh collaborating with us and doing this video I'm pretty excited about it and then Steve an unexpected guest if you want his tables we'll put the description uh his info in the description below and for all you guys out there do me that favor Tell your grandmas, your grandpas, your moms, your dads, your aunts, your uncles, your brothers, your sisters, your friends, your frenemies, your enemies about these videos. Like them, share them, and then get out here to Redfield and stay at one, at one of Juanita's places. Tell her I sent you. And uh, I love you guys. Peace out, and we'll see you next time. Thank you very much. Thank you. Kobe, Kobe.